Kinetti James Fitzgerald Appa. Kinetti James Fitzgerald Appa. Uh, some cowboy over in the Midwest, probably. This seems to be a hot debate on the internet, because for some reason a rumor started when I was younger that I was named after either Nat King Cole or Cole Porter, and that's not true. My dad just liked Western names. Ohio. Cleveland. California. I was born in Arezzo, Italy. Missouri. <laughs> I was born in Juneau, Alaska. South Africa. South Africa. NYU. Same as me. Cammie went to NYU, New York University. The university that's a little less amazing as Carnegie Mellon University, the one that I went to. That's an inside joke. I went to NYU, which is the better school over Carnegie Mellon. That's an inside joke. <laughs> oh, Erin actually went to college in Scotland of all places, which is pretty funny uh, because she still has a little bit of a Scottish accent. So if you listen to Erin talk, um, not, not Tabitha Tate, but if you listen to Erin talk, she actually has a slight Scottish accent. I went to Harvard University. Oh, archaeology. I was an archaeological major. Uh, it was actually, it's, we'll just say archaeology. It's a subdivision of anthropology. I think her mother and her dad because they met there. I was number 10 at Harvard and there were a few people who came after me. So maybe we're around 14 or 15. Oh, I think she was young. <laughs> Uh, 11? Like zero? One? Probably three real? Two. Probably two. Probably last year. I've seen her dance. It's new. Um, two or three? The minute that I started walking, so probably three. I don't, yeah, three. Ish. 16, I'm guessing? I don't know. 14. So, Casey has two siblings, Corey, who's definitely older, and Carly, who I want to say is younger, and he's the middle child. I have an older brother who's married and a younger sister. I have no idea what her birth sign is. Probably, I don't know the signs. What, cancer? Is that right? I am a cancer. I don't know why I had to think about that. I knew the answer. I'm a cancer. <laughs> cancer was right? Wow. <laughs> Gemini. My sign is Capricorn. Something in the arts. I would say something in the arts. Maybe um, sculpting? Drawing? Magic. Oh, magic? Magic! Okay, well now I definitely need to like get in touch with Drew so he can show me some of these magic tricks. She was actually the captain of her badminton team and she was she was like the best badminton player in her high school, in her town, and she almost went to national championships for it. I was varsity cheerleading captain in high school. I was also a runner. Dog. I guess I'd have to say a dog. Olive! Olive! Olive is my dog's um, girlfriend. Dog walking app. Maybe it was called WAG. WAG. A dog walking app. I don't know what that means, but that's a dog walking app. Drew plays the guitar. I play, I dabble with a guitar and, and piano. Yosemite. Somewhere outdoors, camping, hiking. I have a new one, uh, Mount Shasta, but also New Zealand. Country. Hick, country. Hillbilly, country. I don't really have one specific genre I listen to, but I would probably say rock. I think he listens to a wide array of music. So if I had to choose, maybe hip hop, rap, um, top 40 hits, maybe a little rock. That's all of them. But I was in hip hop and rap. Right now, I'm listening to a lot of uh, Chet Baker. 
so uh, jazz and things like that. And my favorite album right now is Donda by Kanye West. I'm in love with that. So that's what I'm that's what I'm currently listening to, uh, genres aside. A song by Sabrina Carpenter. I did a music video with Sabrina Carpenter during season two, I believe, where I played her boyfriend. Uh, fans thought her Twitter account was a stan account for Camila Cabello and Shawn Mendes. A fan account for Shawn Mendes and Camila Cabello. But it's not. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Balmain. Balmain. I feel like she did something for Coca-Cola. Diet Coca-Cola. Chemical Hearts. Chemical Hearts and plus minus. Damn, I am nailing this. People's Choice Award, I believe, and a Teen Choice Award. I think those are the two. I won Teen Choice Scene Stealer. She was on a reality show. Oh my god. Big Brother. Amazing Race. Oh, would it be Power Rangers? Power Rangers. I was in Power Rangers. <laughs> Swimming lessons. Swimming lessons. Again, it's this Scottish dessert. It's called... Cameron? I think it's called Cameron. Not like the name. Uh, it's spelled a little differently, but it's made out of sheep's milk. My favorite snack on set has to be anything that's in the candy world. So airheads, gummies, I always need a little sort of sugar bump, especially on long days. Maybe Korean barbecue. I'm not sure if he said that once. I really love Korean barbecue. A hot tea with ginger and lemon. An Earl Grey tea with oat milk and honey. That's my favorite snack. That counts as a snack. Well, she just changed it up, so she, she just started drinking coffee again. So right now, it's coffee. It's probably like an oat milk latte. Matcha. She'll know. She's gonna get all these right. Ooh, I have no idea. Like I wanna say, I wanna say Casey just likes it black or maybe just like a latte. Do you know this? <laughs> you know the answer to this? I like my coffee uh, black, but I also like an almond milk latte. Salty? I definitely uh, would prefer salty. Yes! She's definitely a sweet person. She loves her candies. Sweet. He's always eating healthy on set, so I wouldn't know that. Was it something in the chocolate world? Um, maybe Snickers? Uh, oh, uh, Jolly Rancher, uh, the sweet and sour um, gummies that they make now. So not the hard candy, but if you ever go to Cineplex or you go see a movie, they have these bags of the, they're called Jolly Rancher Misfits. Jolly Rancher Misfits, delicious. Josie, from Josie, yeah, Josie, Josie, Josie and the Pussycats. Josie. Josie. Ah, uh, I would say like every two weeks or so. I have to get my hair dyed every two weeks. Every two, two and a half weeks. <laughs>